skip counting by tens. It means there is a gap of ten numbers between the given numbers. Four hundred and forty-five, four hundred and fifty-five. Here the numbers are in forward counting order, so we should add number ten repeatedly to get the next number. Four hundred and forty-five. Plus ten is equal to four hundred and fifty-five. Four hundred and fifty-five plus ten is equal to four hundred and sixty-five. Four hundred and sixty-five plus ten is equal to four hundred and seventy-five. Four hundred and seventy-five plus ten is equal to four hundred and eighty-five. Next, two hundred and ten. Two hundred and twenty. Here also the numbers are in forward counting order, so we have to add number ten repeatedly to get the next number. Two hundred and ten plus ten is equal to two hundred and twenty. Two hundred and twenty plus ten is equal to two hundred and thirty. Two hundred and thirty plus ten is equal to two hundred and forty. Two hundred and forty plus ten is equal to two hundred and fifty. Now look at the next example: six hundred and eighty, six hundred and seventy, six hundred and eighty, six hundred and seventy. Here the numbers are in backward counting order, so we should subtract number ten repeatedly to get the next number. Six hundred and eighty minus ten is equal to Six hundred and seventy. Six hundred and seventy minus ten is equal to six hundred and sixty. Six hundred and sixty minus ten is equal to six hundred and fifty. Six hundred and fifty minus ten is equal to six hundred and forty. Next, skip counting by hundreds. It means. There is a gap of hundred numbers between the given numbers, four hundred, five hundred. Here the numbers are given in forward counting order. It means we should add number hundred repeatedly to get the next number. Four hundred plus hundred is equal to five hundred. Five hundred plus hundred is equal to six hundred. Six hundred plus hundred is equal to Seven hundred, seven hundred plus hundred is equal to eight hundred. Yes, eight hundred. Look at the next question. One hundred and fifty, two hundred and fifty. Here also the numbers are given in forward counting order. One hundred and fifty plus hundred is equal to two hundred and fifty. Two hundred and fifty plus hundred is equal to. Three hundred and fifty. Three hundred and fifty plus hundred is equal to four hundred and fifty. Yes, four hundred and fifty. Four hundred and fifty plus hundred is equal to five hundred and fifty. Yes, five hundred and fifty. My dear children, I hope you all understand this concept well. Please watch the video two or three times repeatedly and complete the given worksheet. Thank you.